Hey, Justin Chamness here, CoachJustinChamness.com. And today I want to talk to you about taking pride in your work. Now, what I mean is, is it really something that you invest yourself into? Have you ever felt really good not making any money, but just doing the work for the work's sake? Hmm. Let's talk about that right now. You can't control whether the task at hand is something you like or dislike, enjoy, or maybe you don't enjoy it at all, but you can take full control of whether or not you really apply yourself to the task at hand, taking pride in your work. As you do your best every day at the task at hand and you enjoy the work for the work's sake, you will increase your skill set and your responsibilities will also likely increase as well as your income. A lot of times people say, well, I would do more if I were paid more. Unfortunately, in this universe, the universe of no free lunches, that just simply does not work. One time I asked my boss, hey, what do I have to do to get a raise around this place? And he said, give more. I was like, whatever. Years later, I realized how much wisdom that man was sharing with me in that one exact moment, in that two word sentence, give more. The fact is, when you give more, you accomplish more and you are worth more you become more valuable in the situation. It doesn't matter if you're a janitor, if you're cleaning toilets and mopping floors, if you're flying an airliner, or if you're an entrepreneur starting your own business, taking responsibility to enjoy the work outside of the result that it may not immediately produce is very, very imperative. You have to immerse yourself in the work and strive in the work. How about this? Before quitting your job, try being the best at it. Raise your standards. Oftentimes you'll find the deeper you go and the better you perform, the more enjoyable your work becomes and the more celebrated you are among those around you. In summary, take pride in what you do and learn to enjoy the work for the work's sake. Learn to sit on the couch or in your easy chair late at night and think, wow, I feel proud of myself and I feel good because I did the work that needed to be done today. Regardless of what the result may have been immediately, you put the work in and you did good work. Are you doing the best you can at your work, at your school, at your business? Are you going through the motions? What would it look like if you stepped into your best self? Here's your exercise. How can you become more engaged in your work, your school, or your business? How can you really start paying attention, stop going through the motions, and enjoy doing excellent work with a spirit of excellence for the work's sake? Tomorrow, I'm going to visit with you about cultivating a passion for what it is that you do. CoachJustinChamnus.com is how you can meet me, and I'd love to meet you. All right, I'll see you again tomorrow. Bye-bye.